What is up everybody? Mike here, Panzer here with Hearts of Iron for Germany. We're just trying to get things done, trying to, you know, maybe accidentally start a war so we can have some action. Of course I'm just joking. We, we actually do want to start a war. But hopefully Poland takes Danzig for guarantees and we can get some of our glorious land back. Um, that, that, that would that'd be very nice of them if they allowed us to do that. Hopefully this one, I was about to say, I'd be funny if like they said no and then we had to, you know, quickly get them in port or else things would be bad. I could, let's just see what happens. See if they do it. Come on, you know you want to. Bulgaria submits to Romania. Poland accepts offer. Very good. Ah, it's Danzig War hot. Diplomacy prevails again. We did it. We got we got our land back. We got our stuff back. This is beautiful. Let's get some more motorized. Um, so what do we want to do now? Oh, look, German Empire looks looks like the German Empire again. This is pretty good. So let's actually not. Uh, let, let, let's let's actually not do any of this. Let's just kind of have Rommel just kind of sit right here. Let's just kind of have you. I don't know. Protect against the checks. You can never trust the checks. I guess. Sure. Let's do that. Let's do that. So there we go. We will do that. Um, and safeguard the Baltic. Support the Finns. Uh, we can guarantee Finnish independence. Let's yeah, let's do all the guarantees for all the um, anti-Soviet states and all that. So, independence or Poland is improving relations with the German Empire. So, are we not, are they not guaranteed because they're in a faction or what? what, what how does this work? I think I think I knew, there is some kind of weird scenario that happens because of all of this stuff but anyways we can get another we can get the tank design company uh, reliability and soft attack armor and hard attack max speed let's get Porsche because hard attack you know beating Soviet tanks is going to be quite the big deal anyhow got Albert Castle Ring got them got Rommel doing his thing and all is well all is good so what are you doing you're doing partisan suppress okay so you're doing great purge stuff so you're a little scared um, Poland really likes us because we did Danzig for guarantees you were very happy you gave land to us and we we got it back so it's pretty good Poland this looks, this is a much, you know, Germany, a much more German centric map of Europe. So much German land. Oh boy. Anyways, so what, what's your, okay, so you're still training up. Um, got all of this. There we go. And we got the computing machine, but, which is good. Simber 1938, but I like having decryption just for, you know, even for the YouTube purposes, like seeing what everyone else is doing and knowing about all of that is quite nice. So that's good. Where can we build some more synthetic plants? Let's do there. Let's do, okay. So let's get, some, yeah, let's come, let's get some more synthetic plants and then we'll go from there so yep you are doing an extra research slot what do you do do you have a war with Germany I think you do have a war with Germany option but German Empire must exist and world tension okay so basically the British can go to war with us eventually we don't necessarily have to let that happen. Let's get encryption to help out with that situation. Do you like us? No, because they have we have memo. They they they, they kind of like us. They really like us. Oh, you're you're buying stuff from us. Trade partners. 
I guess I guess Estonia is buying stuff from us, which sure go for it. Love the Estonians. They can buy as much as they want from us. That is fantastic. So let's see. Okay, so you are good. Uh, well, no, I want you to be assigned to this this line here. That that would be very nice. Like this one dude in a horse is just chilling and setting. Like, yep. Just setting up and setting. Just kind of waiting. Maybe a war will happen. We'll see. But, yeah. The Soviets are... Whatever. I don't think we can boost party popularity. Because we can't boost non-aligned. Even though it's, you know... Kind of catch-all for just monarchists and everything else. Um, okay. That, that, that's that. Not a whole lot else to be going on there. Um, hmm. We do want to at some point safeguard the Baltic, which is nice. Our offer of guarantee of independence was accepted by all of the involved parties, which is good. And then support the Finns, and which means all of that. anti turn pact. Iberian problem. Uh, support the Finns. You know what? Finland can Finland can take care of themselves. Let's get the Wilhelm Wagen. Let's get some more civilian factories. We need our economy to be a lot stronger if we're ever going to be go to war with them. So, all of y'all are well. All that Kingdom of Romania declared war in Hungary for what? Okay. I guess that's a thing. Um, hi. Can can we help you? Please. Please don't die. Please don't die. Are you like... Why? Why, why, why Romania? Why are you doing this? What is going on? Romania is absolutely destroying Hungary. Um, okay. But I'm supposed to make Austria hungry again. How am I supposed to make Austria hungry without Hungary? Well, I was just gonna annex them eventually anyway, right. so. Uh, this is awkward. The Hungarians are getting absolutely wrecked by Romania. Uh. What just happened? Uh, good focus bypass, but align hungry. Y y you don't say. Holy Jesus. Bulgaria is a puppet of Romania? Oh no. What are you doing? Balkans. Line Hungary. Split Czechoslovakia. Um, what on earth are you doing? Balkans dominance. Puppet Bulgaria. Secure Greece. Divide you. Oh my god. Romania. The madman is just taking over everyone this is interesting okay so we got our super heavy battleships because of course we did let's get construction why did we research super heavy battleships again that's right I wanted to research super heavy battleships oops well that's kind of fun it's kind of fun I guess so what do we have here? Oh, we can get advisors. Chief of Army Organization. Attack. Uh, and no Army Innovations. Speed. Let's just get Division Attack. Make our, you know, give them a stronger punch on offense. Operation Zet. What is Operation Zet? Oh, you see, you're going to go to war with the, the Japanese. I see. Are you like your own faction? Mutual assistance block. Um, Mao, I don't know what you're doing. I don't know what Romania is doing. Romania is just like dominating everyone. Oh boy. What are you doing? Rolling party, trade partners. Oh no, I want to know like why do y'all like Romania? Anyways, that's fine. What about us? Who likes us? 
Well, all of these people like us. Why does Afghanistan really like us? Trade partners? What? You're, you're trading with us? How is Afghanistan trading with us? They don't have whatever. This game doesn't make sense sometimes. It really doesn't. So. Oops. That is not good. Oh well. Anyway. Let us see what else we can do other than just clicking around everywhere. Maybe we really just need to build up our military. Which we're, we're kind of doing. We're getting some more... Getting some more airplanes. Um, I don't really like close. I don't really. W I don't think we're gonna deal with close air support. Um, Ju87. No divisions in basic training. Do we have how much experience? We don't have enough experience to like make like. Uh, duplicate new division. Can we just make like a small little crappy like guarding division? New division. We'll give them that. We'll just call them the the the, the garrison. There we go. We need we need fifty. Okay, so we need fifty XP for that. Um, Fifteen. We need medium tanks. Paratroop what about paratroopers? Six eight ten. Alright, so that takes some of that. Let's get some support artillery. And then we can add one more. We want recon. Reliability HP initiative. Breakthrough. Let's get engineers in these guys. So how many paratroopers can we get? Seven. One. Well, first of all, I'm not even producing transport planes. So let's change that. Let's get some transport planes building. Um, let's set a really low priority for one paratrooper. Just for now. I also want some marines. But we can't change their template because then, well, then things would be very strange. We got that carrier. We should probably, um, let's go for a better factory output. There we go. That should be good. Okay. Uh, we got encryption. It's 1938. We should start getting MP38s. Okay, we have a lot of stuff we can get in 1939. Panzer 3s getting medium tanks would be good. Uh, so we can start designing those divisions. Although let's get let's get infantry equipment. There we go. We need to actually keep going down these focuses so we can get the extra research slot. So we got the Wilhelm wagon. We can, oh, let's get the extra research slot. There we go. So in terms of construction, we're getting all of our extra stuff, which is good. Um, Zog submits to Italy. Ooh, that's a little scary. So let's could do this. Franken apparently doesn't have anything in terms of this. Uh, you're only at 80%, but you can get some more factories. So can you, and you can get more factories as well. Okay, so that should be good for now. Um, yeah, we, we just need more oil. And uh, we'll, we'll spend some more of our techs on synthetic oil in a little bit too. So let's get you onto the front line with Rommel. We probably want to get some Sparty, some self-propelled artillery, not Michigan State, um, into those mobile division so we can have that working quite well hmm, let's see oh that 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 shows okay never mind why does that show sometimes the sometimes the OBS is weird sometimes it does things differently for for hoy than it does for other ones I need to look at my settings um, 
But anyways, we probably should start considering building a navy, considering the British probably aren't going to like us. But for now, for now we just kind of prepare for war. The world's a relatively peaceful place. Are there any current wars? There are no current wars in 1939. The world is a peaceful place. It is all because we got rid of those evil Nazis. It's great. Okay, let's get improved oil processing. Um, let's get that synthetic refiner, the synthetic refineries, up a little bit better. Um, we're using all of our civilian factories that we can, even though we have 22 going to consumer goods. Not ideal. Definitely not ideal. But we have a lot of steel. We are importing tungsten and we are importing chromium. Um, yeah, so Romania is revise the constitution. What are you doing? Fortify the borders. Align Hungary. Okay, so you are um, you are being quite aggressive. Royal dicta royal dictatorship. Hmm. This is this is a little scary. This is definitely scary. Um, Romania might be. Romania might be a problem in the future. And I mean a problem in the most, with the utmost respect. And we might have to fight Romania. So we got Berlin, we got our dude doing jumping jacks. Rommel almost has, you know, three quarters of his mechanized Blitzkrieg army, which is good. Invest in the old Polish region. Well... Hmm, what should we do? Trying to get our extra research slot. Uh, this would be good. Yeah, getting synthetic rubber and getting an extra bonus. That would be fantastic. Oh, wait, no, we were where we wanted to be. Let's get a military high command guy. Fleet logistics, army logistics, uh, less attrition, recovery rate. Ooh. Infantry division attack would be fantastic. The infantry divisions attack and defense that would be great uh, do we have a theorist we do have Heinz we are our army experience should be ticking up because of Heinz Guderian but it's only a little bit a day it, it does take a while to build up but it, it's it's a little bit we just have Heinz in his office office just kind of thinking hmm I have an idea let's do this so there we go uh, we got our extra research slot which is good should we align Romania? <laughs> Probably eventually. Let's get the coal liquidization, though, for now. And uh, actually, that is all the time we have for this episode. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to leave a like. Consider subscribing to the channel. Follow me on Twitter. And check out my Patreon page. Thank you all so much for watching. Until the next one, this is Mikey Darepanzator signing out. See you, nerds.